good morning guys it's uh, Patrick here PC TV and of all places I'm at Octo in Long Beach at the Long Beach Veterans Stadium here um, this is a little bit of a departure for me it's a big bus show and swap meet came out here with my buddy Brian Ray and we're uh, selling some stuff we've got his uh, converted panel and I'm gonna be doing some walking around and uh, checking out the show yeah, I guess doing my walk through Octo here and all kinds of vendors. It's a swap meet, it's a show. We've got survivor buses here. We've got panels. We got low riders. And one of those things is I've seen is this new brush guard style that I'm not familiar with. I've seen a lot of the shop trucks and panel trucks. Look at this uh, 23 window man, BFGs on it. This thing is ready to head to head to Mexico. Nice patina, plenty of rust. It's got it all going on. We got these vicious wagons over here. I really like these a lot. But they're running these trippy brush carts now. These are new to me. Um, this is a design I'm not used to. I'm sure it has some you know, significance, but I don't know it. Uh, he's got his flagpole set up on here. But what's really cool about this one, this is an original shop truck. Look at this, Winds Friction Proofing Performance. This was a Winds Performance van. This is so freaking cool. And then he went in and did a so-called vicious uh, wagons. Um, tied it in really nicely, but it's Fred Wynn, and if you know Wynn's products, it was all about, you know, slickening through your engine. It was definitely, uh, you know, snake oil of the day. Wynn's performance products, you guys know that stuff very, very well, but there you go, friction proofing. Just super, super cool. Um, yeah, this is quite a contention of the vicious wagons, man. These guys are really pulling on some great stuff here. Here's a 58 over here. These are all swap meet guys too, so yeah, we can walk the swap meet a little bit here, get an idea what's going on. Brian and I are set up over here with his bus. We got just tons of stuff man, everywhere you look. Let's look at these buses. That's really what I'm here to look at. Take a look at all these great buses. 23 window, rag top, maybe 65. This is the stuff I grew up with as a kid. My folks always had buses. Look at this one here. This is a double barn door reverse. And it's a seven panel. This is what Brian's van used to look a lot like. And he's got canopies on both sides. Super, super clean. 64, double door. And it's got the camper kit in it. This is great. Got a nice canopy and everything. Very, very cool. Here's this black to silver that was coming in this morning at 6 with us. We rolled here at about 6.30 this morning. And man, look at this thing. It's got the beautiful pop-outs on it. Red interior. The motor sounds beautiful. Don't know what's in it. Look at this. You get the full slider roof on it. And he's got the jail bars on it. There's tons of stuff. Look at this red interior on here. There's a lot of goodness going on in here. Kind of hard to see the reflection. Let me see if I can get a shot inside the window here. Yeah, it's it's a pretty it's a sweetheart. So yeah, so this is my Saturday morning, and a little little departure from my normal gigs, but uh, a lot of fun. Just tons and tons of bus stuff, VW stuff. Like I said, we've got stuff for sale. Um, of course, we got music. We got Steve Miller over here. Get a welder for hire. But yeah, um, Octo 2021 here. Look at this thing, man. It's like a fire truck. Love this flat on top here. Pretty sick. And there's that brush guard again. I gotta learn more about those. I don't know anything about them, but that's really cool. I love that top headlight. And a single cab. The wheels are sick. Wow, those are some great wheels. Side boxes. Now over where we are, there's a guy who has a full tent set up in one of these. And I'm gonna show this to you in a little while. Look at that rear pop out on this. Front and rear pop outs, this is sick. And it's gotten real bright out here, but again, you know, I got going late because I was actually selling stuff as soon as I walked in the door. Look at this. Another nice, just, was an eight window. Look at the, the powder coating here, the work, all the finish work. I love the fact he's got his headlights turned sideways like that. That's badass. The double Fresnel. Look at this interior work here. Exceptional. Look what we got going on here. She's a sweetheart. 
a lot of good stuff going on. Yeah, when you look down the road here, it's just massive, man. Plus, as far as you can see, got a lot of music goes here. Oh, he's got AC on this one. That's not a little AC rig. I'm thinking about doing that. I love that car AC. Look at these buses, bro. I mean, they're just top notch. Top of my stuff. Look at this 23 window that's rolling right now. Red and white combo. That thing is just sick as can be. Another nice single cab right here. We got a. It's like a semi panel. It's a passenger bus. It's like the one we had when we were kids. Really, really sweet though. Music's gonna kill me here, but I gotta get some shots of this thing. I'll try, hopefully, the mute will work. Oh, look, he's got the same carpet as in the bud. Square block carpet. This is the bus we had when, when we were kids. My, well, my parents had it. We got in a really bad wreck in it. Oh, we almost all died in it. It was my first bad injury as a kid. I was three years old and I got a super bad car accident. So, of course, me and my sister were in the back and my parents were in the front of the bus and there's no seat belt, so we flew all the way from the back seat all the way into the metal in the, behind the front seats. But anyway, that's a whole other life and decade. Um, yeah, look, this is cool stuff everywhere. Oh, there's an alternator set up I need, but I'm gonna do something a little nicer. This guy's got carburetors, distributors, all kinds of stuff here. But again, I'm here to look at buses. I'm gonna work my way back to Brian. Yeah. Oh, this is like Brian's color right here, the mango. Just tons and tons of buses here at Octo. And all the signs. If you're got, if you're into signs and stuff, this is what you want right here. Here's your sign guy. Good stuff here. Like the wagon. Wonder much for the wagon. Oh, I, oh, I love the dog. Dude, the car art is great. There's some good car art in here. I'm liking this. Especially the Westinghouse. This, oh man, this little roadster is just awesome. I know somebody who would like that a lot. Yeah, I really like this little Westinghouse car. He wants 300 bucks for it, man. Somebody I want to give it to a gift for, but it's just a little out of my budget. All right, so moving on through Octo. There's a Haro right there, man. You don't see those too often. Those are old school right there. And uh, let's keep on rolling. Yep. Oh, there's Brian over there. I wonder if he's made any money for me while I was gone. <laughs> yep, another great bus. Again, all kinds of accessories for sale here. There's just, dude, it's just like, if you're in the, in the buses, especially buses, this is just pure heaven. I mean, look at this here. Everybody's having a nice time hanging out here. It's starting to look a little more Halloween-y. We got toys. If you're into the toys, man, you got the toys, toys, toys. I'm ruling. All kinds of great stuff in here. The double crew cab, window bus. Oh, a nice little Westie, earlier Westie, 63 maybe. Very cool. I like the early buses, they just weren't the greatest for camping, but look at that. He's got a cool little uh, canopy right here and full interior. Yeah, got the sink and everything in here, it's all correct. So, this is a true Westie, the early vintage. I think it only had the single bed and you had the pop top. And then later, of course, they went to the full tops, and then you had the uh, double bed setup, or at least the hammock in the earlier ones. Another 23 window. Now, here is the crazy setup here. This is the living room right here. This guy has got himself an imagination. And I'm getting back to my campsite, but look what he's built here. This fits entirely under his box in the van. It all slides in. This is a full blown lounge built in the back of the truck. Of the truck here. I'm very proud of it. He's done a great job with this thing. It's just amazing to look at it. I love it. This thing's so bad. It's sick. PCTV. Hey! What's it? Hey, the people you run into here. What is up, my brother? Good to see you, Robert. Robert Only on Alba. PCTV. Well, you know, this. but you only find it on PC TV. That's right. <laughs> and I got stickers, so uh, I got. I'm right here, <laughs> right here. 
We're sitting right here with my buddy oh, Brian. Nice. Yeah. Uh, I would just getting that. rid of some of my on my bug oh, stuff. Yeah. Some of my, yeah. So we're just hanging out. So I just nice. walking around. I was just showing off his uh, insanely yeah, cool setup. Nice? So yeah, this is Octo, you guys. So I'm gonna take a break and visit with a friend, and uh, we'll talk to you later. Look at this guy. Yeah, that's the idea. That, I'll tell you, that's probably the best setup I've ever right seen. <laughs> this has got to be the coolest setup ever. Yeah, this works. All right, he's one upping us over here with this cool little setup, huh? I tell you. <laughs> that is just amazing. That is so cool. Creativity. Got your living room. Here we go. Octo. This is our little booth here. Just chilling, stiff. Want some heater boxes? I got heater boxes. So, yep, chill show here. I don't know how long we're gonna stay. Hopefully, we're gonna split here a couple hours. Get out of here by noon. Get some lunch. Yeah, it's not bad though. Kind of digging it. It's pretty cool. So, yep. Yeah. Um, Octo Show, Veteran Stadium, Long Beach. All right, so here's part of my Saturday spent with my buddy Brian here. We're at Octo, and this is our little table. This is all my junk out of my garage. Gotten rid of a good uh, amount of stuff. I'm uh, pretty stoked on that. So, what do you think, Brian? How'd we do today? Making money, right? Making money. And son. There's your bus, looking Cars. bad. And then we got this killer tent set up. You guys have not seen, I, I think what he did here is just amazing. This is great. You've got a full lounge set up in here. Hi there. Your dad did awesome. I love it. This is just the coolest setup ever. I mean, this is your living room right here. Oh, I saw, oh, you just rolled the mat out too. Very cool. Not like having your living room with you. Just, just take it with you. But yep, this is a really, really cool pickup. A Bonneville National, look at that, 1978 sticker from the Bonneville Nationals. I love the history of these cars, man. That's what makes these things, the buses and everything, just so freaking cool. Alright, so there's a look down the row here. You just see there's just tons and tons and tons of buses everywhere. Just on and on and on. And again, there's tons of merchandise. And, well, he's got that cool flip top on there. That's pretty dope.